Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do your daily vibe for Thursday, March 8th. We are just going to see whatever comes up. I might do a Let's Talk tonight. I'm thinking about it, so if you want to hit the notification bell, then you'll get notified. It's up to you. You don't have to. I might do one. It all depends. You know, sometimes some something happens, but I'm planning on it. Many of you are thinking about moving forward, leaving something. And I know we had this yesterday as two. Something was very similar. But this is, you know, the Eight of Cups next to the Six of Swords. Maybe you're you're leaving something behind. You may just be thinking about it at this time. Yeah, you are. <laughs> Many of you are going through a period of contemplation, you know, focusing on what you really want in the future. Um, there's a lot of inner work going on at this time. Look at that. Definitely moving forward. I mean, the Six of Cups were next to the Strength card. You're, you're definitely finding your inner strength at this time. Um, opening up, letting go. Letting go of uh, some sort of emotional attachment. It's like, I'm, I'm ready to let this go. I'm going to use my inner strength to and discipline and willpower to move forward and bring peace and harmony back to my life because we have these sixes. It appears that um, you may be some closing some doors to the past after a period of really focusing on what you want, you know, and now probably now's probably the time to take action, you know, charge, charge ahead. Um, yeah, it's after a period of resisting change. I, I you know, I... I've sat here long enough and sacrificed enough time on this dilemma and I've come to this conclusion that it, it is time for me to to bring peace and harmony back to my life. Um, that's what this is. It's like I'm, I'm letting go. I am letting go. And I know this is very similar to yesterday's, but, you know, energies don't just come and go. Sometimes they last for days or weeks or however long it needs to last until you actually take action. So many of you have been resisting a change. You've been holding on to something that doesn't serve you. But it feels as though now you are being called to struggle through it, to just look at this from a new perspective. And I think that's what many of you are doing. You've really focused on the, the plan ahead, and now you're probably taking some sort of action. All right. So it appears that um, maybe you're letting go of something from your past, it could even be a grudge, uh, whatever it is, you're letting go of something that you have held on to for a very, very long time. And it brings about some sort of uh, wish fulfillment, okay, because this is the star card. I mean, I see, I think there's an exciting new discovery, a new path ahead of you that um, has unfolded and now you you really want to head in that direction um, it's like a renewal okay it's a like a renewal after a period a time out a period of healing healing your inner self you come to the conclusion that you have the confidence and you have the courage to to move in a different direction so it, that's what it looks like it's like you're acting on your hunches you're you're moving along very very well um, and it feels like there is some sort of new faith okay because this is the star it's like this new faith in the future there's new hope there's there's new hope restored okay it's like you're, after your period of reflection, your hope has been restored, okay? And now you've, we have this renewed ability to move forward, 
that's what it looks like to me. It's like now you're 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 excited for the future, where in the past I think you were going through some sort of emotional turmoil and just trying to come up with a future plan. Now I know what I need to do. I have the confidence and the courage to do that, and I'm going to head in that direction. Okay. And I feel like you're you are being divinely guided as well to do that. I mean, that's what I it feels like to me. I mean, we have a we have a few majors right here. Okay, one, two, three, four. So I feel like you have been divinely guided to to head in a new direction. And I think that this is the day, or this is the energy, this is the time period, because it's energy, like I said. And it's very similar to yesterday's reading. It's the energy of, I can do this, I am going to do this, and I'm moving forward to bring peace and harmony back to my life. It looks like you've worked on mastering your emotions, and it's that's what's happened. It's, that is exactly what's happened. I have mastered my emotions to the point where I'm more at peace with what I need to do. Friendship. I understand that a friend in my life is in my life for a reason. There's somebody in your life for a reason. Who is this person? Who is this person? When I say this, who do you think of? Who is this person that's in your life that is in there for a specific reason? Do you know? There could be somebody in your life that is a friend that could turn into love because I saw this at the end of the deck, but I didn't. I didn't say anything, but now that this came up, I'm going to go ahead and show it to you. This is the Ace of Cups. There could be there could be somebody in your life that is just a friend and it could lead to more. There could also be some sort of reunion because um, that Six of Cups can be a reunion and so can't this. So for some of you, there could be a reconciliation or a reunion with somebody from your past that was a friend that leads to love. Maybe they were just a friend way back when, because this could be from your childhood. And now, um, you know, it turns into a love interest. That could certainly be the case. And progress. Charge forward, and I think I said that earlier with this card, even though it's, you know, it's the strength card. I do believe I said charge forward. Be willing to make mistakes. Go forward. It looks like you're being divinely guided to go down a new path and to find your, your strength, your willpower, your discipline, your courage, and your confidence to take action, to restore peace and harmony in your life. And I think that you've taken the time to reflect and come up with your future plan to release emotional um, turmoil that's been holding you back. And I feel like there was some old friendship, maybe from way back, that could turn into love. And you're being called to charge forward and follow your dreams and wishes. Okay? That's what's, what's happening here. So I think it's time for you to, to stop resisting and charge forward. Move forward towards this interest that you have in regards to bringing peace and harmony to your life, whatever it is. I think that, I think that you're ready to open up and stop resisting, stop resisting change. And as you stop, I feel like you're div being divinely guided to to move forward and take risks. And it's, I think this involves another person. So anyway, this is what I have. Talk to you later.